We have a new Batman call that's been added into the game. Let's talk about it. Hello heroes and villains, welcome to Multiverse. So we got the Ultimate Batman pack that's been added into the game. And there is a new call included in the pack. Basically, it's a long-eared bat call. It's pretty similar to the Dark Knight call, we'll compare it in just a second. Uh, the main distinction is that the, the ears are longer, but uh, the texture is a little bit different. The way the lighting works on the, the call is a little bit different. But here, let us start with the chroma material. So you can see, uh, normally materials cover the, the complete uh, call, but in this case, you can see the chroma material leaves the eyes white. Uh, this is the bright cosmic chroma material. But here you can see what the call looks like with the black royal chroma material. So you can see that Normally you would need to use like the bug goggles, we'll take a look at that in just a minute. But uh, with uh, most of the chroma materials, you still have the eyes of the character. Although the eyes are kind of small, so in some cases you may still want to use the bug goggles. Or if you use a material, like for example here the stealth material. Most material completely covers the eyes of the, the headpiece. So sadly, you have to use the bug goggles in some cases. It's not exactly it, but... Uh, it kind of helps to keep uh, some sort of uh, eyes for the character, even though that it's not really the eyes of the character that we see. Also, people asked if I could show the Batman from uh, 1989 with the skull, and uh, here we are. Obviously, the best option is to use the stealth material. It does create the rubbery look that the costume had way back when. Also, I'm using the slimline chest piece uh, because way back when the emblems uh, were not that big. But you could decide and cheat a bit and go with the stalwart defender so that you can get a bigger emblem. And with the stalwart defender style, you have a whole bunch of lines that are kind of reminiscent to the Batman costume from Batman Begins or the Dark Knight. Which is a bit ironic because uh, basically that's where Jim Lee took inspiration from when he designed the new 52 costume. Also, something that the Flashpoint Ghost Rider made me realize uh, yesterday is that you can actually see the beard through the mask. Uh, with the Dark Knight call, if you equip a style that has a beard, uh, the beard doesn't show through. But in this case, it actually does. So if you want to have like a scruffy looking beard for your Flashpoint Batman character, now you can. So now that we can have long ears with our Batman, we can just create something that is a bit closer to Batman from the 70s and most of the 80s thanks to those long ears. Although I have to admit, uh, when we asked for the long-eared Batman call, I had more something like the classic Batman in mind. So I guess I foolishly expected us to get uh, this headpiece when we asked for long the long-eared uh, Batman call. But they seem to actually have given us the call from the modern Batman. As you can see, this is pretty much spot on for the call that we just got. It's not a big deal, but you can see that between the choices of uh, long-eared Batman call that the, the devs uh, could have chosen, uh, they decided to go with this one for some reason. I guess they don't like the classic styles very much, or they just prefer the more modern styles. Oh well. And if we take a quick minute, we can compare it to the Dark Knight call. So here you can see what the Dark Knight call looks like. And here you can see the new Bat call. The Dark Knight call looks like. New Bat call. The Dark Knight call looks like new bat call. So you can kind of see that the lighting does react a bit different on this version of the call. So it's more than just making the ears a bit longer, they kind of reworked the, the textures a bit. So it does give us a somewhat better option to create the classic version of the Batman character. Although it still works well enough to create a Frank Miller Dark Knight type of character, although the short ears might be a bit better for that. But uh, ironically enough, seeing how the character is almost uh, almost becomes a silhouette with the black like this, uh, the long ears actually makes the silhouette uh, a bit easier to see as opposed to the short ears. And of course, you can try to enhance the look of the character using uh, various materials. So here we can see what the character looks like with the shaded comic material. Or the void material. Although with the void material, again, you will need to use the bug goggle eyes. And I almost forgot to mention where or where you can get the skull. It comes from the brand new Ultimate Batman bundle. The bundle contains a lot more than just the skull, and is at 25 bucks if you're not a subscriber. If you are a subscriber, you get 10% off, so it's 22.50 if you are a subscriber. 
I know that some people will find that expensive just for a call, but uh, way back when I purchased the Dark Knight call when it was uh, 20 bucks when it was first released. Uh, here we have uh, the call for 25 bucks, but we also have a whole bunch of other stuff. Yeah, odds are, if you've been playing for some time, you probably already have the Batman Beyond suit or the Swarming Bat Aura. But if you're a new player that uh, just started playing, a lot of that stuff will probably be new to you. And even if you are an older player, you could probably give some of that stuff to some of your alternate characters. But I assume in some cases, uh, the call is probably the only thing you really want to purchase from that pack. Again, way back when, we bought the Dark Knight call for 20 bucks. So now for 25 bucks, they, do, they did try to give us a lot more value than just the call. Although a lot of that is uh, reused items, sadly. And it would seem that once we get the headpiece, we can then purchase it for our other characters using 50 replay badges. So if you want to have this new Batman call, you will have to get the ultimate Batman bundle, either from the marketplace or from the loyalty vendor, you decide. 